Hi guys, so here is a demonstration of playing back Spotify playlists on your Raspberry Pi. So this is possible even for free users. You need not pay your monthly subscription fee. So I have got a Raspberry Pi uh, speaker P hat from Pi Maroni and then the button shim again all that also from uh, Pi Maroni. So I have configured the buttons for controlling the different aspects of the script. So the C uh, will start playing, B and D are for switching tracks and uh, A and D are for volume control. So as you can see it is fetching all the details from the Spotify. So if you want to switch between playlists, you just uh, press and hold the uh, track controlling buttons. So I have switched the playlist. So again, you can change tracks on your new playlist. You can pause and resume the playback. So there are a number of different ways to play back your uh, Spotify playlist on your Raspberry Pi. You could either use MoPD or uh, Spotify plugin or Volume IO or Spotify Connect. So all of them uh, are not for free users. You need to be a premium user. So to dodge uh, all the DRM related issues and uh, to enable the free users to play their playlist on Raspberry Pi, I have taken a roundabout approach. So using the Spotty Pi uh, Python package, we'll get the playlist details and then use a uh, YouTube downloader to fetch those tracks from YouTube. So I have put together uh, all the scripts in this git page. Uh, the instructions are pretty straightforward and easy to follow. So if you have already tried playing Spotify playlists on your Pi, then you should be familiar with this process of getting your Spotify credentials. And uh, apart from these two steps, uh, the, instructions are, uh, the instructions are pretty much straightforward. Uh, if you have a button shim, uh, you can out of the box start using this uh, example that I have given. Otherwise, uh, you might have to play around with the uh, files or the scripts that I have given here. See, you can uh, modify this button shim script that I have given to work with any uh, push button. So you can have multiple push buttons and just modify the uh, button shim example to play your uh, playlist. Otherwise, if you're just intent on playing one playlist, you can use this uh, parse uh, argument script. But again, uh, while using that script, you will use your ability to switch tracks and play and pause all that kind of stuff. So these are the two uh, examples that I have shown. So I really hope that uh, you find this helpful. And Enjoy playing back Spotify playlists on your Raspberry Pi for free. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.